I'm Matt Sweeney and I grow hops. This is a hops plant and these things will grow as tall as the trellis as I can build them. And come end of August, beginning of September, uh, we come out here and pick all the cones. The Wisconsin Hop Cooperative. This is a group of Midwest area hop growers to help really build the hop growing industry in Wisconsin. We really are trying to get to that 100 acres to really create a sustainable business. This serves our, our needs for being able to process and sell to local brewmasters. We use pelletized hops from the Hop Exchange and we decided to make a beer to highlight and specialize featuring these uh, wonderful hops called the Wisconsin Hop Farm Pale Ale. The development of this hop industry in the state is in its infancy. Gorse Valley Hops is a group of growers that uh, are all focused on gathering enough quantity of hops to supply to a brewer. We have uh, several acres, several thousand pounds of production, and uh, that's finding its way into our Wisconsin craft beers. We are proud to source a lot of our ingredients in the restaurant, in the kitchen that is, and uh, some of our brewing ingredients locally. Uh, some of those are from Gorse Valley hops, and we grow some of our own hops as well. We uh, like to do a lot of barrel-aged beers here, generally stronger ales, and they spend time in, in barrels, sometimes up to six months to a year. These came from Yahara Bay Distillers. Besides for making beer, it's also used in a number of uh, food industries for its um, antibacterial properties. A long time ago, way back in history, when all there was to drink was nothing but cups of tea, along came a man by the name of Charlie Mops, and he invented a wonderful drink and he made it on a 